are listening to Digital Pratees podcast where you going to learn digital marketing for free every single day. Please do give me a review if you find something interesting over here. Please do give me a review because I keep on learning every single day something new. I keep on applying that something new which I have learned in my life and I'll keep on sharing that something new which I have learned and applied and maybe I got some awesome results. Welcome to this another episode of Digital Marketing Podcast where Digital Pratik is going to discuss something about WordPress, what exactly is WordPress and understanding the history of WordPress itself. So what is WordPress and why WordPress? WordPress themes, WordPress plugins, etc., etc., etc. A couple of people don't even know what plugins is. So let's understand in detail and to the point of what and why WordPress is. Now there are a lot of other platforms on which you can build your blog or a website. Tumblr, Blogspot, WordPress, Blogger, Magento, etc., etc. So then, why WordPress only? because let me tell you wordpress is also known as cms for which cms stands for content management system and it's the easiest platform you can build your website upon um as of if i tell you as of february 2017 i read this somewhere uh, on the wordpress website itself around 27% of the websites in the world are powered by wordpress and why people like me and you should think of wordpress in the first place is because it's a brilliant platform for people who are non technical and have no coding knowledge i am personally a three times final year dropout by choice from engineering background and trust me i am a proud uh, founder of digitalmarketingforfree.com which i personally have built by my own uh, without any technical skills yes digitalmarketingforfree.com is built upon wordpress.org WordPress is also known for its community. Uh its powerfully com- its powerful community comes from WordPress's open source CMS software which is powered by PHP and MySQL. Now there are plenty of freelance developers who are developing WordPress themes for WordPress platforms. And to make it simpler for you, WordPress is just a platform on which you are building your website and WordPress themes and plugins are used to enhance the performance that is the look and the feel uh, maybe the design speed and a lot of other factors of your website so let's take a real example uh, to understand this digital concept let's suppose um, you want to build your own house so for that you will have to purchase a plot first or a space or a naked space or a land on which you want to build your house so consider that parallelly in the digital space as your wordpress platform all right so consider that plot parallelly as your wordpress platform compare the, those two things now next you will need to have put up bricks lay the foundation and the house will be built so those things compare that with wordpress themes and then finally you will want to have the furniture interior decorations and things like that so that you can compare with wordpress plugins so first to summarize first you need a naked space on which you want to build your home that is wordpress platform then you will need some foundational levels bricks and all those things cement all those things compare that with wordpress themes and finally inside once it is built you need furniture interior decorations and things like that which you can compare with wordpress plugins so wordpress is that simple for people like me who don't have any coding knowledge just like blogspot which is owned by google its parent company wordpress is also owned by automatic so wordpress was first started as an all round blogging tool and has turned into a constantly evolving content management system if i tell you the first version if i'm not mistaken the first version of wordpress was released as an open source project licensed under gpl v2 and in the last past uh, 14 years wordpress has evolved as the most popular platform for creating blogs and websites wordpress was co-founded in 20 Uh, 03 that is 2003 by Matt Mullingweg and Mike Little and WordPress is backed up by its parent company Automatic which i mentioned earlier as well so it's also uh, it also offers various wordpress related services and products a uh, few to mention are wordpress.com wordpress jetpack uh, videopress and if i remember gravatar wordpress vip and there are a lot of others all right 
Let's talk about WordPress themes. WordPress is backed by a huge community of freelance designers and development companies. Uh, now these guys, they offer free and premium WordPress themes. And one of the biggest challenges for a website today is to have a great design. And WordPress themes are the solution to that problem. So anyone can download a WordPress theme for free from the official WordPress repository or third party website. And if you want to go for a more professional route, you can pay a small amount and get a premium WordPress themes. If I talk about uh, WordPress plugins, the most interesting thing about WordPress are the plugins. Trust me, plugins enhance the core features of the WordPress software. They help in adding new features to your WordPress powered websites. And uh, there is a WordPress plugin for almost every damn single thing inside WordPress. Uh, you can download WordPress plugins from the official plugin directory for free or you can get them for uh, for a couple of price that is premium stores uh, so it's the same wordpress themes are also free and paid and wordpress plugins are also a couple of them free and a couple of them are premium so what are you waiting for feel free to let me know uh, what do you think about this podcast by writing a review and if you liked it do give me some likes and do give me some subscribe hit i'll see you in the next podcast till then take care bye bye and as always guys stay awesome god bless and take care Hey, 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 wait, wait, wait. Before you leave, before you leave, let me just tell you that please do give me a review. If you find something interesting over here, please do give me a review because that helps me rank over here and stand out from the crowd in digital marketing space. And that helps me boost my confidence in giving you and providing you as much possible as I can with the value stuff every single day to enhance my digital marketing knowledge. All right. So I'll see you in the review section and do give me a subscribe. Hit. Thank you.